morning, Gators. It is Wednesday, November 2nd. Welcome to Gator Nation News. I'm Jaden. And I'm Brayden. It's a lot going on in the studio right now. Brayden, how are you feeling today? Feeling all right. You getting your pictures taken today? Yeah, unfortunately. I don't really like taking pictures, but I have to do it. What about you? Uh, I think I'm getting mine taken. I'm not 100% certain, but I should be staying after school. Well, I've noticed you've gotten a haircut and shaved, so I'd really hope you were taking the pictures. Yeah. Unless you got a date. Hmm? You got a date? No. So, yeah, you're taking pictures. Okay. <laughs> Due to the chance of inclement weather on Friday night, this week's football game, Gators versus Clearbrook, has been moved to Thursday night, November 3rd at 6.30 p.m. at Challenger Stadium. The DHS swim team will have a swim meet on Thursday, November 3rd at the Texas City Natatorium starting at 5 p.m. Be our guest for this year's all-district musical, Beauty and the Beast. Students from all over the district are excited to share this wonderful story with you. Performances are tomorrow, November 4th and 5th at 7 p.m. and on November 6th at 2 p.m. Pre-sale tickets are $10 for students, $15 for adults, and $8 for children 12 and under. At the door tickets are $15 for students, $20 for adults, and $10 for children 12 and under. Light at Windows Open Doors will close at 4.30 p.m. on Thursday, November 3rd. Air Force Junior ROTC had a very exciting weekend, setting up, cooking, cleaning, and serving the most amazing hamburgers, cheeseburgers, chicken tenders, fries, nachos, and smoked sausages to thousands of customers. They even had time to visit the Blue Angels pilots in between serving their customers and air show demonstrations. Just in their three booths, AFJROTC sold over $30,000 worth of food product as they volunteered their weekends. Both days were 12-hour shifts. Keep up the great work, Air Force Junior ROTC. Boys soccer trials will be held Monday, November 28th from 3.30 to 4.30 p.m. Before you attend trials, a physical form, both written and two online forms, have to be filled out and turned into the athletic trainers, which are located in the DHS Fieldhouse. Also, you currently need to be passing all classes or pass all your 9-week-1 classes. You may go by Coach Edinburgh's class in 2022 if you have any questions or need to pick up a physical form. Make sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at Gator Nation Media and on Twitter at Gator Nation Live for the latest news and live updates. And if you're a staff member with interesting stories or information you want included on Gator Nation News, make sure to send them to our email at gnmedia at dickinsonisd.org. That's all the news we have for you today. And now for the inspirational quote. The amazing can only be created by facing fear, risk, and failure during the process. We'll see Superman you said that. Sorry. We'll see you tomorrow on Gator Nation News. And now for the fun fact of the day. Did you know the first live-action Spider-Man incarnation was in the 1971 Electric Company show? In it, Spidey spoke through speech bubbles to encourage young viewers to improve their reading skills. That's it for today. See you tomorrow.